How to fix your Mac's camera when it doesn't work? Restart Mac. If you don't shut down your Mac and keep it running or in sleep mode, it doesn't have the opportunity to reset itself. That means it can't get rid of any bugs or glitches that can appear and create problems like the camera not working. It's healthy to restart your Mac even if you shut it down for the night, as the issue could have occurred in the current session. Quit apps using the camera. Click on the Apple logo and select Force Quit. Select the app that is using the camera and click on Force Quit. Wait for about 15 seconds and then open an app you want to use the camera with and check if it works. Remove screen time restrictions. Click on the Apple logo. Go to System Preferences. Select Screen Time from the left sidebar. Select Content and Privacy and go to the Apps tab. Next to the Allow section, make sure the box next to Camera is checked. Give Mac Camera necessary permissions. Click on the Apple logo. Select System Preferences. Then go to Security and Privacy and select the Privacy tab. On the left sidebar, click on Camera. On the right side, you'll see apps that want to use Mac's camera. Check the box next to the app you want to use to allow access to the camera. If the box is grayed out, click on the lock icon and enter your password. Update the app. Open the App Store. On the left sidebar, select Updates. You'll see all apps waiting to be updated on the right side. Update the app that's trying to use the camera. Reinstall the app. Open Finder. On the left sidebar, select the Applications folder. In the list, locate the app and right-click on it. From the menu, select Move to Trash, or simply drag the app to the trash. Then, clear out the trash. After a few seconds, open the App Store. In the search field, enter the app you deleted. Click on the arrow with the cloud to re-download the app. When the app is downloaded, open it and check if the camera works. Update your Mac. Click on the Apple logo and go to System Preferences, then select Software Update. Wait while your Mac searches for updates. If found any, update the operating system. Check the camera system report. Click on the Apple logo and select About this Mac. Make sure you're in the Overview tab and click on System Report. From the left sidebar, click on Camera. It should be under the Hardware section. You should see your camera's model ID and other information on the right side. If you don't see any information about your camera, it might be broken or unavailable. Reset System Management Controller The System Management Controller is responsible for managing certain parts of your Mac's hardware. Resetting the SMC might help you solve the issue with the built-in camera. This method is for Intel-based Macs only. Visit our guide linked below for more information on how to reset System Management Controller. Run Apple Diagnostics to run Apple Diagnostics for Intel processor, press your Mac's power button. Then, press the D key on your keyboard at the same time your Mac starts to boot. When asked to choose the language, release the D key and select your language. When the hardware test is initialized successfully, wait for about 2 to 5 minutes. You'll get the diagnostics report. Make sure to write down the report codes you get. You can then Google the meaning of the code or contact Apple support and they will explain it to you. To run Apple Diagnostics for Apple Silicon, press and hold your Mac's power button. When you see the Startup Options window, release the power button. Press and hold the Command and D keys on your keyboard. Then, click on I Agree. When the hardware test is initialized successfully, wait for about 2 to 5 minutes. You'll get the Diagnostics report. Make sure to write down the report codes you get. You can then Google the meaning of the code or contact Apple support, and they will explain it to you. Hopefully, this video provided the information you were looking for. If you're using a Mac computer, we would like to suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. It will check your computer for malicious software infections and advertising supported software. The Disk Cleaner option will scan your computer for app caches, logs, downloaded files, and files still sitting in the trash. It will also show you how much space what files to take up on your Mac. Combo Cleaner will also help you look through all big files on your Mac and delete those you don't need. You can also scan Mac for duplicate files. Sometimes you might not know that you have a few copies of the same file. A privacy scanner that will help you remove cookies, cache, browse history and more. 
and an app uninstaller that will find all hidden app components and uninstall them for you. You won't need to worry about viruses and clutter on your Mac anymore. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel.